Hey YouTube, Brian LCS. Thanks for stopping by the channel and this video, new comic book day pickups for April 20th and actually April 13th as well. So uh, I did not pick up books last week, so I'm going to show you those first and then we will look at the books from this week. So up first, you can see here is Batman 89, number five. Um, I have not read this story and I know this has been um, quite some time since we've seen an, a new issue. Uh, issue four, I, I'm pretty sure it came out two or th maybe two months ago. Then up next we have another Batman, Batman Catwoman number 11. And up next, Noctera number nine. Captain Carter number two. Darth Vader 22. Miles Morales, number 37. What if Miles Morales became Wolverine? Uh, the first issue of this series, the new What If with Miles Morales, was okay. Kind of a retelling of the Captain America story, and it had a few... Uh, to me, it felt like, in, uh, felt like Into the Spider-Verse. So... I, I was considering dropping it, but I went ahead and picked it up this week because it's Wolverine. So we'll see. We'll see how this story goes. If this, if I don't enjoy this one, I'll certainly consider dropping it. Venom number seven. And that is the last book from last week. And now we'll move on to this week's book. Hulk number six, the one that everybody's specking about. Captain America Zero. This is um, the uh, this is one of the Alex Ross covers. Spider Gwen, Gwenverse. This issue two, uh, issue number one was not really a favorite of mine. I figured I'd give it one more issue and then. See if I want to keep it or not. We Live, number two, Age of the Palladiums. Um, jumped in on this. You know, I did not read the first um, series. Um, I really heard great things. I read the Free Comic Book Day version of the first series, which was really good. This... Um, this storyline, the black and white issue one, was just okay for me because I, I, not having the background of the original series, I think, detracted from this second series. Nice House on the Lake 8. And then last but not least is Refrigerator Full of Heads. And there was another cover um, that I was looking for. And this is the issue six. This is the last of this series. Um, there was another cover with um, one of the shark heads on it that I was really looking for, a really great cover. But my uh, LCS didn't have it when I when I got there. So, so I have, um, so you saw Noctera and uh, Nice House in the Lake. Uh, so I have a question for you guys. I haven't read either of these and I've heard great things. I do want to read them. But it, if I only had one of those series to start with, which one would it be? So let me know down in the comments. Should I start with Nice House on the Lake or Noctera? Now, I'm not a big, big, big horror fan. So um, I believe Nice House on the Lake, and I haven't really read much, even about, you know, the kind of overview of the story is more kind of a, you know, I know it's set in a house, and, but, um, with that in mind, let me know. Let me know what your recommendation is. Which one should I start with? Uh, nice House in the Lake or Noctera? Uh, and that's it, guys. I hope you had a great uh, new comic book day. And we will see you next week.